Yo, what's up, gang? It's your boy, King Koopa01. Back at it again with another unboxing. This time around, I got a package today in the mail from Strictly Limited Games. It is a limited print company catering to making physical editions for games that normally wouldn't get a physical edition. So, as you know me, um, I have a collector's edition in front of me for this game, Coffee Talk. This is one of those kind of like, um, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Like, um, like story driven type games. Like, um, I don't want to say like a maybe a novel. I don't, I don't, I don't know the word exactly what I'm looking for, but it's one of those type of games. I actually uh, found out about this game from an ASMR artist. That was uh, actually doing a let's play on her channel and it's a chill relaxing game with very chill and relaxing music um, I was trying to see if this if this is a numbered release but I don't see any on the back of the box so you basically play as a person who, who has a coffee shop that caters to all species, including humans, fairies, uh, vampires, um, shapeshifters, wolf, uh, werewolves, cats, cat people, like all type of people. Slip cover. Oh, it came um, very well packaged. But, um, yeah, I know it's been a little minute since I uploaded anything. I've been pretty busy with personal stuff. Um, but yeah, here is the inside of the box. It is magnetic. Or, you know, yeah, magnetic. So That's the style of boxes they have been going with lately from uh, Strictly Limited as far as uh, their collector's edition go. First thing you greet with is the CD soundtrack. This one has 12 songs. This two has 12 songs as well. Well, technically 11 with a bonus track. I will open that up. And hold on, let me see if I can get it open now. I thought I felt. Well, let me get the knife. Yo, I seen an unboxing from another channel. Like, that was super fast. Like, when I say, like, she literally showed everything in her collection vision. Well, basically, almost everything in her collection edition. And under like 30 seconds like I was like what including like unboxing it from the like the mailbox itself and everything so a double disc soundtrack oh it's one of those I'm not really sure how you uh like how you get these open lanes. Okay, we're not gonna fumble with it <laughs> with that right now. Like I don't wanna break it, especially not on camera. Uh insert sheet is just an insert sheet, nothing on it. All right, sorry for wasting so much time on that. I apologize. And you're greeted with a Coffee Talk postcard, strictly limited postcard. Do people actually use these? Maybe I might use one day. Also, you have what looks to be like art photo cards. A 
they kind of look like actual photos, but I'm pretty sure it's paper. Take the camera back a little bit. So these are some of your customers and patrons that come into your coffee shop. You know what I'm saying? The premise of the game is to basically make the type of coffees, I mean, yeah, the, the type of coffees or beverages they like. Similar to another game that I'm after. Uh, I'm kind of mad I missed the Collector's Edition. It's called Valhalla. And um, and that game you play as a bartender, but this one you play as a barista. So that's what's on each of back of the, uh, you know, these cards, whatever. But, um, yeah, man, that's pretty much it for that. This is like um, one of the main, well, all of them are main characters, but like she comes into the shop quite often. You see me? I haven't played the game, but I have seen the ASMR Let's Play. So I'm, I'm familiar with, you know, like what goes on. Sometimes the customers will actually like tell you what they want and sometimes they will like, um, basically tell you like surprise them or whatever you know what I'm saying and depending on like how you do it like you might um, unlock a different um like story path or a story you know unlock some more they they backstory basically pretty decent book Like I said, this game is known for its art style, its very chill vibe, and very good music. I'm not gonna go through the whole book because I'm already made this video unbelievably long, especially compared to that 30 second video I seen earlier, but she didn't like go through the book or anything like that either. Well, yeah, like here is, um, one of the ca uh, characters. I think he's a werewolf. And here's some of the early concept art for him. So. But yeah, so this book is officially 91 pages. And it has a lot of story, like comic, comic style stories in the back. So, you know what I'm saying? Pretty decent um, collector's um, edition for this game. Here is uh, another item. It is a sticker sheet showing some of the characters, I guess, like in, um, I don't know, different parts of the city that they live in. It is an actual city, but I cannot remember what it is. So, whatever the city is with the, I think the Space Needle. Comes with a pretty decent poster as well. As you can see, it kind of looks like a, almost like a movie poster. You feel me? Well, yeah, man, it's like, um, Two other games that I know of. One of them is getting ready to come out from Super Rare. I think I'm going to skip that one. And it's very similar to this one. And the one that I, I didn't get, but I'm on a hunt for for a decent price, is Valhalla, the Collector's Edition. I'm pretty sure, you know, if I really wanted it bad, I'm pretty sure I could score one from somebody um, in the group. Oh yeah, I forgot about the main thing. Uh, the game itself. So here is the game. Okay, so it's released 32, so... That wasn't on the back of uh, the slip cover. Nope. So this is uh, release number 32. I don't know, let's get the unboxing knife. Here 
submersible cover as it's the same as the poster. Could have been, you know, decent if they changed the style. You know what I'm saying? I have three different, you feel me? But, um, oh yeah, so it is Seattle. The city is based on is uh, Seattle. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for Coffee Talk. It is your boy King Cooper 01. Uh, remember to treat people the way you want to be treated. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Now I'm going to clean up my mess. And yeah, peace out.